Hi third graders, it's Miss Mangan here, and today we're gonna to test your knowledge of primary sources and secondary sources. So let's remind ourselves what the difference is. A primary source is a first-hand account of someone who experienced and participated in the events that we're studying. Primary sources include things like letters and diary entries, notebooks and interviews, photographs, books and magazines that were written at the time of the event. A secondary source is a second-hand account. It's created by someone who did not experience it firsthand or did not participate in the events that are being studied. So secondary sources include things like history books and textbooks and movies about the historical events and biographies. People who were not there at the time but studied primary sources in order to analyze and to write their own opinion about it. So today we're going to be looking at task cards. These are going to be cards that you are going to look at in order to decide is it a primary source of information or a secondary source of information. So here's an example of four of the first task cards. So let's look at the first one. Number one says, is this a primary source of information or a secondary source of information? A memoir. Now a memoir is when a person writes a book or a story about events in their own life. So if it's happening from the person's perspective, it's written by the person, about the person's life, what do you think? Primary source or secondary source? It's a primary source, you're right. You're also gonna be looking at biographies, photographs, autobiographies. Now remember the difference between a biography and an autobiography is that the biography is written not by the person who lived that life, and an autobiography is when a person writes a story about their life and they are the author of that story, of that text. So think about the difference and how that might change the difference between a primary source and a secondary source. So when you're determining this primary source and secondary source, you're asking yourself, was the person telling that story, telling the account present at the event? So you're going to record your answers to these task cards on this recording sheet. And today you're going to be looking at task cards 1 through 16. You can either print this or you can copy the slide that I'm going to provide and paste it into your e-learning slideshow. If you print it out, you can either post your work on Seesaw or you can go ahead and put it on the e-learning slideshow. So here's what you're going to do. You're going to look at each task card. You're going to coordinate the number and then you're going to put the letter answer in the task card recording sheet. So let's look. Number 13 was the one we looked at yesterday. Is an email a source of a primary or a secondary source? And we decided it was a primary source because it was at that time. So I'm going to put A in section 13. Now, I would say when you're done making your guesses, we have this really awesome part of our phones and iPads that if you just pick up the camera and take a photo, it's going to zoom in on that QR code and a little box is going to pop up and tell you the correct answer. So how cool is that? So after you're done, you can check your answers to see if you've gotten them right. What I think would be super fun for today is to try this work with a friend. Work together to read the cards and take a guess. So while you're on Zoom or you're on FaceTime, go through each one together. Do number one. What do we think? Write it down in your own recording sheet. And then one of you go ahead and scan and see if you're correct at the end. So I hope you have some fun with this and that you learn a little bit about primary and secondary sources and you get to work together with a friend and use some technology so it should be good. If you have any questions you let us know but remember was the item there or the person there at the time of the event then it's a primary source. Good luck third graders.